The overall goal of the following experiment is to investigate the recovery of nutrients from nitrogen-rich streams using either an electrochemical or bioelectrochemical approach. The former approach is achieved by passing the stream through an electrochemical system which after oxidation of water creates a driving force that can be used to flux charge ammonium from the anode side across an ion exchange membrane to the cathode side. As a second step, the high pH at the cathode side results in the conversion of ammonium to volatile ammonia. The high level of selectivity of the ion exchange membrane enables the creation of a pure ammonia hydrogen stream. Next, the catholite is circulated through a stripping and adsorption column in order to trap the ammonia in an acidic medium. The electrochemical extraction can also be driven by bioelectrochemical processes where the development of a biofilm on the anode allows the conversion of organics present in the waste stream into carbon dioxide, protons, and electrons. This will again drive a flux of ammonium from the anode to the cathode. The results show that both approaches can recover nutrients from nitrogen-rich streams such as urine. The conventional uh, nitrification, denitrification approach on wastewater treatment takes the ammonia from the wastewater and turns it into nitrogen gas, which goes back in the atmosphere, so we lose the nitrogen. The advantage of our approach is that we take the ammonia and we recover it in a clean form, so we can do something with it, we can reuse it or convert it to another product. A second advantage of our approach is that we use electricity as a driver. It's essentially a clean and cheap source of energy and it avoids the use of chemicals. Demonstrating the procedure will be Sylvia Gildemain and Steven Anderson, both PhD students.